Hello, today we will learn how to print sum of n natural numbers. Uh, we can do this using a while loop. Also, I will tell you another method where you don't have to use a while loop and that program will be much faster. So, what is sum to n natural numbers? If n is given as 10, so we have to find the sum of 10 plus 9 plus 8 plus 7 plus this is sum to n numbers that would be 55 so sum of first 10 natural numbers is 55 so we can do this using a simple while loop let's say n equal to 5 we will have one more variable called sum which will be initially 0 all we have to do is add n to sum sum plus n ok now 5 will be added so next time what we have to do this is what sum 5 plus 4 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1 so 5 has been added now we have to add 4 so we will reduce n by 1 so n equal to n minus 1 so here n will become 4 now we go back now we will do sum equal to sum plus n this time n is 4 so 4 will be added to sum now I come down again now n equal to n minus 1 so n will become 3 and then we will go back in a loop and then do this so at the end n will become 0 we are subtracting 1 each time right at one point n will become 0 and that's when we stop so that is the condition for our while so let's write the program we have an integer n equal to 5 comma another variable to store the sum which initially 0 we will say while n is greater than 0 because when it is 0 we have to stop so whenever it is greater than 0 we will do sum equal to sum plus n n equal to n minus 1 or you can also put n minus minus both are the same thing and then we finish the loop so after this entire loop is completed we will be having the variable sum with the final value which we want so we will print that so instead of using while loop instead of using this whole while loop we can do this in one line we have an arithmetic progression formula for sum to n terms and it is n into n plus 1 by 2 if we use this one formula we don't have to use this entire while loop the problem with this while loop is if n was 100 this loop has to run 100 times so instead of that if you use this formula it will be much simpler instead of this whole thing we will replace this with one simple line sum equal to n into n plus 1 whole divided by 2 and then we will print it if you think you have learned even a little bit from this video please leave a like and consider subscribing to my channel thank you